1989, Concorde suffered a structural failure, half of its rudder being ripped off. On the 12th of April 1989, Concorde Golf Bravo Oscar Alpha Foxtrot on a chartered flight from Christchurch, New Zealand to Sydney, Australia, suffered a structural failure at supersonic speed as the aircraft was climbing and accelerating through Mach 1.7. A thud was heard. The crew did not notice any handling problems and they assumed the thud they heard was a minor engine surge. No further difficulty was encountered until descent through 40,000 feet, 12,000 meters, at Mach 1.3, when a vibration was felt throughout the aircraft, lasting two to three minutes. Most of the upper rudder had separated from the aircraft at this point. Aircraft handling was unaffected, and the aircraft made a safe landing at Sydney. The UK's Air Accident Investigation Branch concluded that the skin of the rudder had been separating from the rudder structure over a period before the accident, due to moisture seepage past the rivets in the rudder. Production staff had not followed proper procedures during an earlier modification of the rudder. The procedures were difficult to adhere to. The aircraft was repaired and returned to service. In 1977, Concorde cost £23 million.